Are you a rugby fan? Do you support a country that isn't New Zealand? Then keep on watching, because I'm here to try and help your team beat the All Blacks. Now those Kiwis might not be unbeatable at rugby, but most of the time, these are the kinds of headlines we've gotten used to seeing. Year after year after year. It seems like they're just always the team to beat. And how do the rest of us rugby playing countries try to get past them? By shutting down their free-flowing game plan? By trying to rattle them? That's going to get you the odd upset, but it's not going to change the world order. That kind of thinking is for losers, and we need to kick it into touch. If the rest of the rugby playing world doesn't want to live at New Zealand's mercy for decades to come, we've got to start thinking big. It's not about stopping them. It's about playing rugby as well as they do. Just like us, they've got two arms, two legs, and a rugby ball. It's about time we stop treating them like gods. As a professional sports journalist, it is my contention that the world's top rugby coaches are not thinking in terms of how to create as dangerous and effective a try-scoring machine as the All Blacks. It is also my contention that New Zealand shouldn't be all that difficult to copy. Just watch the match videos. What I think these coaches need is a practical and convincing manual on how to build their own All Black machine. With your support, I intend to go to the ends of the earth to research and write that particular blueprint. My dictaphone is ready for interviews, my passport is ready to travel, here's my laptop and I even have coffee. I am good to go. All I need is funding. The global rugby community desperately needs this and the sooner we can get it out there, the sooner your team can be winning an entire series against the All Blacks.